Hi everyone. Today in this video I will share with you all a case of palpitation and gastroesophageal reflux disease in a female of 43 years. This lady presented with a complaint of palpitation and severe acidity. She said that all her symptoms used to get worse especially at night. She felt an intense throbbing in the region of the heart which was aggravated lying and was better while she moved around. Apart from this, she also complained of having frequent stomach upsets and also complained of having very loud emission of flatus. She had been to many cardiologists of the city and said that in spite of taking many cardiac remedies, she was not much benefited by them. All the investigations were done and there was no significant structural anomaly and all the symptoms were related more to the gastric sphere rather than the cardiac sphere. This patient appeared to be very nervous. She used to suffer a lot from anxiety. As a child, she used to have recurrent panic attacks. And what was peculiar about the case was that the sufferings which the patient complained of were not of a very severe character, but they caused immense distress to the patient. So, based on the cardiac symptoms as well as the gastric symptoms, the medicine that I prescribed in this case was asafoetida in ascending allopotence. When we go through boric, we come across flatulence, hysterical and hypochondriac patient, throbbing nightly pains and loud and difficult eructations. And when we read Boger Synoptiki, we will get the complete picture of this case in front of us. In the modality section, it is given worse at night. Asafoetida is a deeply syphilitic remedy, often given for the worst bone complaints that are seen in syphilitic or mercurial patients affects the left side, heart being predominantly towards the left. Fits of violent hard throbbing. This is given in bold. Then it says magnifies her symptoms. Hysteria. Now the symptom of the case that is given under Bogart synoptic E is heart seems full, distended, reflex, heart symptoms of nervous origin. As there was no structural anomaly seen in this case, the symptom was at the functional level. So asafoetida suited this case beautifully and gave me an amazing result. What is important for us to realize is that we have to understand the essence of every drug, of every medicine of our material medical. Because till the time we know of the different sphere of action of the drug, the miasmatic picture of the drug, we 
are not able to utilize our material medical to the fullest. So this case again taught me as a fit eater and I would like every one of you to go through as a fit eater and look at the syphilitic and the hysterical element of this medicine. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.